Yep, it's RV Life checking in from Doe Divas Farm here in Iowa. As you might remember on our last episode, we were at a Harvest Host location at a winery in Nebraska. And we just came from Nebraska, now we're in Iowa, and we came to this great farm right here. Want to take a look around. Now this farm is a dairy farm, but not a cow dairy farm. It's a farm for sheep and goats. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be looking at some sheep and goats today. We might even be able to milk a few of them. And I'm excited to show y'all this great farm and talk a little bit more about harvest hosts. Man, harvest hosts, I'm so happy I discovered this. This is such a great way for people living their RV life to park in unique places that might be different than the regular RV park or campground. Here we go. Uh, Here, these sheep like to talk to uh, us. Uh, Here, now I'm in the back with the sheep and the goats. And now we're just looking around here. I think I'm going to be helping milk these guys. This this little guy right here has been following me around. Hi, Mr. Goat. How are you? You're real sweet, aren't you? Hi, Grace. How are you? I'm good. So we're about to start milking some goats and sheep, correct? Yep. All right. I can tell you their names, too. All right. What are their names? This is Starburst, Jupiter, Toast. She doesn't have one. She doesn't have one either. And this is Skittles. Skittles? Yep. I love Skittles. Here and here. So there's just a little bit of a trickle, so she's going to be done soon. But she's still got a little bit coming out. So you massage it, and then it'll kind of release what she doesn't want to give you, <laughs> so to speak. You're getting the, the hidden treasures in there. <laughs> So I heard the name this sheep, Dolly Parton, for a real big udder right here. It's got a lot of good milk in there, I bet. Here, and I'm about to go milk the goat mops myself, and this is what I've learned since I've been here. So I've got to take this, put it up, oh, up here, nice. Hey, Mr. Goat, don't kick. I throw all these right down? Here, she wants to show you. Here? Yeah, you don't hold her legs. So, you know, Alright, you want it? Alright. Alright, Alright. Now, when you stay at a Harvest Host location, you're supposed to buy some of their nice products. And as you can see here, they make a bunch of soap with, uh, with uh, the sheep and goat milk, I guess is what they make it with. And here's the process for them. It's real nice to be able to support these small farmers. And one of the things I'm really looking forward to trying is they make these ice cream sandwiches with their sheep and goat milk. I bet they're real good. And then they also sell some cheeses and other things down there. It's really good. This is a really good place. It's sort of, it's pretty cool to see this coming from Chicago and everything. You don't get to see farms, working farms like this very often. And as you can see in the general uh, lobby area, they have this viewing area where you can watch them make cheese with their golden sheep milk. Jennifer, how are you liking that cheese? It's delicious. Here. What's your favorite one? This marinated feta. This jar might be gone by the end of tonight. You're gonna eat a whole oh. jar of feta cheese tonight? I might. It's so Here. good. Well, looks like our dogs got some. What other cheeses do we get? Is that one good? Would I like that one? I think so. All right, I'm gonna give that one a try. Oh, and we got some soap too, right? Mm -hmm. Oh man, that soap really smelled good. And I have four ice cream sandwiches that I put in the freezer. Oh, by I thought the way. you said you ate four. Oh no, I didn't eat four. I'd have a big belly. Well, a bigger belly than I have now if I ate all four. Well, guys, I tell you what, dough and divas. 
look this place up. They got a website. It's real nice cheese and dairy products. Highly suggested. Yep. Well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed our episode here about our second night on Harv Associates at D and Divas Farm. And man, it was a great time. They had some great cheese. I highly suggest checking out their website and ordering some for yourself. But in the meantime, this is RV Life signing out. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel, RV Lifer. You can subscribe to us by looking at the bottom right hand corner of this video and click the subscribe button.